All right, Pisces, what is up? I'm here to do a collective reading for you guys. Hope everybody is happy, healthy, safe, and doing well. All right, into the smoke. We release all energy that does not serve us, all negativity that surrounds us, and all fears that limit us. So it is. Thank you, angels, spirits, guides, God, universe, ancestors, and the highest and the most high for guiding us Pisceans in the right direction. <laughs> All right. <sighs> All right. So, with that being said, let's get into your reading. Anybody sending any black magic? Hojo, vojo, jojo. Towards me or my Piscean Collective. Please return that shit to sender, spirit. Positive vibes only on this channel will be taken. Alright, let's get into this. Let's get into this reading. If anybody would like a personal reading, um, I have a little bit of time available. Well, maybe for tomorrow or the next day. <laughs> Alright, so messages for Pisces. Oh, we finally get this card. Okay, number 24, Potion, the Basic Witch, okay? <laughs> All right, not Basic Bitch, Basic Witch. All right, uh, Potion, remember the practice of self-love. Number 24, let, let me read. All right. You're familiar with the concepts of self-love, self-care, but either... You've never actively practiced them, or there's something you've been falling behind on. Either way, you should get back on track. Keeping yourself maintained in all ways, big or small, can mean calling it quits to a luxurious, to take a luxurious bath instead. Okay, calling it quits to take a luxurious bath. Sorry, I read that wrong. Um, instead, or that can mean putting on a rose water face mask. And getting out your planner so you can sort out your life before it gets too out of control. Okay, so some of you guys may need to um, practice self-love, self-care. I know for a long time, me personally, I was like, shit, I love myself, you know, da, 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 but I didn't actually understand what it meant to have self-love or self-care, you know. So take time out. A lot of us have really busy schedules. Take time out to do something that you love, something that you enjoy that is beneficial for you, okay? It can also mean getting your life in order, planning things, um, organization skills as well. So let's go into the tea leaf deck and see what other messages do we have for Pisces. What other, what other messages, spirit, angels, and guides do we have for the Piscean Collective at this time? Thank you guys for all your likes, subscribes, comments, and shares. You guys fucking rock. Yo. And in that reading I did yesterday, too, um, I read a lot of your guys' comments. I've been trying to take a little break um, and reading that, you know, just, you know, self-care, okay, <laughs> by not reading some things. Not saying that all of your guys' comments are negative, Nancy, because by far I have the best support on my channel. Like, I feel like I get <laughs> a lot more positive feedback than negative, and it's all because of you guys, so thank you. So we have a broken wishbone. A wish will not be granted. Okay. All right, and then we have the weeping willow, family sorrow. Why do I feel like we... I'm getting, like, deja vu vibes. Okay. Let's see. What else? What else for Pisces, spirit, angels, and guides? Can you tell us what messages may be helpful for them? Oh, we get the bag. Take that one. The bag. Something important such as a new job or a raise. <laughs> I've never got this card. Getting to the bag. There's 120 cards in this deck. And I feel like I've been through all of them because I use it often. Um, but I have not had the bag. Pisces. Don't start causing mischief, okay? Anybody got time for that? Anyways, hammock, taking a vacation physically or mentally, Pisces, self-care, self-love, getting out there. I know. Okay. I keep my plans to myself. Never mind. Never mind. Okay. Hammock, maybe taking a vacation, y'all. Um, 
Then we get the cobweb, protected from negative forces beyond your control. Okay. And dark man. Dealings or relationship with a man with a dark complexion or dark hair. All right, so let's break this down, see what's popping for the Pisces. Let's see, broken wishbone. A wish will not be granted. Why is this showing up for Pisces today? What does Pisces need to know? Now keep in mind, energy can be flip-flopped, it can be reversed, so if I'm saying that... She's so bad. If I'm saying that, you know, a wish will not be granted, this does not necessarily mean that this was your wish, Pisces. This could be somebody else in your energy field. So keep that in mind. Don't get too hung up on the signs or um, stop, woman. Excuse me. Thank you. All right, a wish will not be granted for Pisces. Angels, spirits, and guides, please give me clarity. King of Wands reversed and the lovers. Could be a Gemini or a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. You have a King of Wands in the reverse. Lovers in the upright, okay? So I swear every time I get on here to do a reading. One second, y'all. Okay. So, a wish will not be granted. King of Wands reverse to the lovers. Somebody here may have had choices in love. Could be an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. But somebody here is angry, egotistical, pissed off. <sighs> Sorry, I'm out of breath. <laughs> Thinks that their shit doesn't stink, okay? This person right here uh, is like an entitled, arrogant, um, angry, very passionate this person may also use passion as a weapon with this lover's card. They may have other, you know, suitors, choices in love. This could also be a soulmate connection. Somebody here... Somebody here may be wanting a relationship. The lovers can also be about a union, okay? Somebody here could be wanting a relationship. We have a wish will not be granted. I don't know why the hell I just pointed at you, but... <laughs> a wish will not be granted. So if somebody here is coming in, like... Feeling entitled, like they think that they have this shit in the bag. Uh, I don't think they do. I wish will not be granted. Five of Pentacles on the bottom of the deck and Five of Wands. Holy mackerel. Six of Swords. You're moving away from this. So, thank you, Spirit. I just adore you. Okay. Five of Pentacles, Five of Wands. This person, there's competition. There, This person's feeling left out in the cold. You could be leaving this person out in the cold because of drama, conflict, strife, jealousy, whatever. You're moving the fuck away from this, okay? Wish is not going to be granted here. Family sorrow. Show me family sorrow. What is this weeping willow? Page of pentacles. This could be about a child or a... Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This could be a message about a child. Page of pentacles. This could also be about news about a child that somebody here feels trapped in a situation. Somebody here could be feeling trapped in a mental prison. Somebody could also be in jail. Somebody here could be feeling stuck from sending a message, sending a message of good news. This could also have to do with child support. So maybe somebody here is feeling stuck. Somebody could also be going to jail for child support. Okay. There's some type of family sorrow involved here. All right, give me one more on this Eight of Swords. Two of Swords. You may not see this. Justice, yeah. Okay, so this could be something going down in the court system. Uh, Libra and energy here as well. You may not even see this, Pisces. You may have your eyes, you know, fucking closed. You may be standing here protecting yourself. Yeah, because right below that is protected from negative forces beyond your control. So I feel like you're you're protected from what you cannot see. You're protected from the unknown. Two of Swords is about being unable to make a choice or a decision because of something, some type of information that you do not have. So there is a moon in the background. So I do feel like there is some secrets here. Um, maybe surrounding somebody who has legal issues or the court system, justice system. This may be so. 
This may be involving a child. Page of Pentacles is typically like a message of good news, but somebody here is feeling trapped and bound in a mental prison. This could be in regards to child support. You may not even see this or somebody doesn't see this coming. There's a betrayal here. Two, two of Swords, Eight of Swords. That's Ten Swords. Something here is going to be made fair and balanced with this Justice card as well. Libra and Energy. There could be a Libra involved. There could be a Libra child as well with this Page of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Okay. There's some type of family sorrow surrounding the situation. So let's see. Something important such as a new job or a raise. Show me the bag. Show me the bag. <laughs> so we get Queen of Cups. Oh, and the hanged one reverse. Both in the reverse. Wow. Okay. And King of Cups on the bottom. Something important such as a new job or a raise. So somebody here is like lacking the clarity or somebody here is refusing to see something from your perspective. Pisces, this is your energy. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Um, I feel like you, you pulled back your emotions. You know, you could be, a, somebody could see you as being emotionally manipulative, Pisces, but this, I feel like you're just focused on your pentacles. I'm going to pull one more card. Um, You may also have a soulmate coming in, but I feel like you're closed off to love. Queen of Cups in the reverse. Tell me more. What is the Queen of Cups in the Hanged One reverse spirit? The Empress. And Ten of Cups. Whoa. Okay, something important such as a new job or a raise, Pisces. I feel like you, you pulled back your emotions. You're not showing your emotions. You're not giving your emotions. You're not giving shit, okay? Um, maybe but in the past you weren't using your intuition, but somebody here is refusing to see things from your point of view. I feel like you're focused here on the bag, getting to the bag. Something important such as a new job or a raise. You're a butthead. Okay, I do feel like you're the Empress. You're moving towards your Ten of Cups. Wish fulfillment, happiness, happy life, happy family. This is the Apex card, the Ten of Cups. This is emotional fulfillment, okay? A happy family. The Empress, she's abundant. Taurus, Libra, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Energy. You could be a mother. You could be a baby's mom. Um, this may be in regards to, you may, okay, you may be starting a family as well. I feel like somebody here doesn't understand why you don't care. Hanged one reverse. It's like refusing to see something from Pisces perspective from the Queen of Cups. Okay. Somebody's refusing to see why you don't care. Why you why you're the Queen of Cups in reverse. Why you don't care. Why you don't have any emotions for something anymore. I do feel like you have emotions for something. I just feel like it's not from I feel like you you are very nurturing, very loving, caring. That's why the Empress came out. You're very abundant. Okay, Ten of Cups. You're fucking happy. You're good. You're going towards you're going towards what makes you feel good, Pisces. I just feel like somebody here is not understanding why you don't care. Like this is a certain person who is like, because spirit is here to say, no, you are the Empress. Ten of Cups, okay? But somebody doesn't understand why you don't care about them, about a certain thing anymore. Okay, I'm getting out of that. All right, taking a vacation physically or mentally. What is this out here for Pisces? I feel like you're going to get justice in a situation. I do see a betrayal here with this Ten of Swords sticking out. Um, and the Justice card in the upright page of pentacles. This could be justice for a child as well. Or child support, you could be receiving some message, a message of good news. This could come through the court system as well with this justice sitting in the upright. All right, the scales are going to be balanced. You may not see this coming. All right, taking a vacation physically or mentally for Pisces. If this reading is resonating, please hit that like button. So seven of pentacles, six of wands. Wow. 
Moving towards success and victory, planting your seeds and watching your harvest grow. You may feel like something here is taking a while, or you may feel like um, you could be like trying to save up your money for a vacation as well. Or looking at, you know, the time, the effort, the money that you have invested and trying to um, take, take a vacation physically or mentally. Tell me more. Oh. And there goes the Ten of Swords on the ground, and Five of Swords, and Seven of Cups. So there's a lot of confusion here, two Sevens as well. There's a lot of confusion here surrounding... <laughs> there's some jealous people, Pisces, and I feel like you're, you're... You're in your cocoon. I don't know if that's how you even say that word, but um, cocoon, cocoon. Okay, you're in your, your, your hammock, all right? You're in your hammock. There's a lot of, like, got, slow down. There's a lot of confusion here. A lot of smoke and mirrors. People trying to win at all costs. Jealousy, strife. This person is looking back at, like, the damage they caused because of greed. All right? This person's kind of like, if you see their face, they're looking back and these other people are walking away in defeat. It's like this person's kind of like, all right, I won, but now what? Or at least, okay, so it's like I, I was fighting somebody. Somebody here, I feel like somebody here was causing jealous, like somebody was jealous and they were causing problems, gaslighting and slandering. And somebody here may have just walked walked away, surrendered. These people are just like, fuck it. Instead of coming back and like fighting some more, they're just like, all right. I feel like somebody here walked away from the jealousy, the strife, the confusion, the smoke and mirrors. All right. And somebody here is like, well, damn, you're not going to fight with me anymore. Like, look. Damn, okay, so I did all this and you're just going to walk away? You don't want to fight anymore? You don't want to... You know, what, what? Pisces is like, no, I'm fucking taking a vacation, physically or mentally. Either way, you're fucking... You're like... I'm out. I'm out, y'all. I'm out. Show me protected from negative forces beyond your control for Pisces. Protected from negative forces beyond your control... Nine of Wands, I totally just seen that too. Okay, and Three of Swords and Page of Swords reverse. So whatever this shit is, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini energy here, I feel like you're taking a new new leap of faith, okay? <laughs> you got your you got your your phone playing music, you got your earbuds in, and you're just like la da di da. Like I don't fucking see or hear anything. Aries energy. This is, you know, a lot of yellow. It's happiness you're loyal to yourself going towards self-love there's a dog here so it's like loyalty you're loyal to yourself and your own happiness okay nine of wands somebody here somebody here is standing behind the scenes watching feeling defense like you may have your guards up but somebody here is like they're watching you from the sideline page of swords in the reverse too but Somebody here can't come towards you. They can't communicate with you. This could be somebody that broke your heart. You're protected from this. This is something I don't feel like, well. I feel like you see it. You're the Empress. Justice is in the upright. The Empress is in the upright. Ten of Cups in the upright. Like, you see clearly what was going on here. And that's why you just fucking walked away from something. You're going towards something important, such as a new job or a raise. I feel like the scales are going to be balanced, made fair here. You may see receive some like a message here of good news. And somebody doesn't understand why you're not feeling stuck in a mental entrapment. Somebody could have been confused about a choice or a decision. Maybe somebody had a choice between two. But there's, in both of these cards, they're fucking blindfolded like... Either somebody tried to keep you like this, and then I seen the Ten of Swords earlier. It's like eight and two swords. There's a betrayal here. Somebody here. <sighs> Shit makes my stomach hurt. Okay, Page of Swords reversed. <sighs> I 
somebody's little immature communication here is like, I don't even feel like it's being received, you know? Because you're protected from negative forces beyond your control. This comes out all the time for you, Pisces. You're protected from some type of third-party heartbreak. Could be an Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Could be someone who's younger than you, who's trying to fucking make you feel like like giving up. Somebody's trying to make you feel like you want to give up, but you're protected from this. So whatever. Let's move on. All right. Dealings or relationship with a man with dark complexion or hair. Dealings or relationship with a man with dark complexion or hair for Pisces. The tower could be a Scorpio. Nine of Swords. Somebody here is trapped up in their head, losing sleep at night. Oh, that came out with two cards. I'm going to put it back. But Nine of Pentacles and the Tower cards. Somebody may be wanting to move towards you slowly. Um, this may come as a shock to you. But I, again, I feel like somebody's losing sleep over this. It could be this dark, um, dark complected or dark haired man who's, you know, feeling anxious, worried, depressed, losing sleep at night. Trapped in a mental prison because they're feeling left out in the cold from a situation. This could be the same person up here. This King of Wands reverse. Yeah, Seven of Swords. Wow, somebody here got caught. Seven of Swords in the reverse to the Ace of Cups. Somebody here got caught. And now they're feeling defeated, left out in the cold. They're very low vibrational at this time because of some deception that was found out. This could have been about a blessing. It could have been about a baby, a pregnancy. Could have been about a new beginning in love. What is this, Ace of Cups? Holy shit. The temperance reverse. Somebody's somebody's not balanced here. That's so crazy because, well, I guess a lot of these cards. Well, not all of them. This person has a darker complexion as well. Man or woman. Same with the Seven of Swords and the Nine of Swords. So whoever this dark-haired man or woman is this person's trapped in a mental prison because they got caught and they're whoa shit okay that went way over there they're very off balance give me a second okay so they're very off balance okay they could be lacking patience as well Okay, so keep that in mind. Somebody here got caught. Show me temperance. This could be a Sagittarius as well, or somebody with Sag heavily aspected in their chart. Okay, yeah, Ace of Swords reversed in Five of Cups. It's like this person is sad. This is like lack of clarity. This is untruthful communication this is cutting things out that no longer serve you somebody getting cut the fuck off because of some type of dishonesty or lack of clarity somebody here is crying like literally crying up in their head at night losing sleep feeling feeling like whoever this dark-haired man is they're they're really going through it okay nine of swords five of pentacles seven of swords reverse somebody got caught here now they're left out in the cold from a situation they're in a very low vibrational energy, losing sleep at night because of deception that was found out. Now they're crying about it, crying because they were looking at other options, not seeing the Two of Cups still standing right behind them. And they chose, like, there's either no new beginning here in communication or somebody needs to come in with the truth and they're not doing that. So they could fucking sit here and wallow in their... That's three... Oh, wait, two fives. three fives out here so there is definitely some type of major change this could be someone you share a family with as well okay because we have the ten of cups we have family sorrow with this weeping willow so somebody here this king of wands who had choices in love they're not going to have a wish granted here broken wishbone king of wands reverse to the lovers could be a gemini aries leo sag but somebody here is still arrogant uh controlling thinks that their shit doesn't stink they can't control their desires their passions they're mean all right with this king of wands this is somebody who's very passionate 
and uh, possibly gets a lot of attention, could use sex as a weapon as well. All right, this may be a soulmate. Or this is just someone who has options, okay? And a wish is not going to be granted here. There's some type of family sorrow. It could be about child support or about some type of a betrayal. Could have been a pregnancy or a baby on the side as well. Somebody here doesn't fucking understand why you don't give a shit anymore. This person is not balanced. They're off balance. They're crying about a situation. They're going through some type of major change because they got caught. I feel like you just decided to walk away from the shit. Like... You could be looking at your finances, thinking about taking a vacation physically or mentally. But I feel like somebody here was trying to win at all costs, create a bunch of smoke and mirrors, illusions, surrounding love. And I feel like, look at these women in the background. They could turn around and easily pick up a sword and come back at this motherfucker. But are they? No. They're just like, all right, you want to fucking fight? You want to talk about me? You want to gaslight me? You want to slander my name? Go ahead. Go play with yourself then and your fucking little swords. I'm a walk out and I'm a disconnect from this situation. All right. And now they're now this person's kind of standing there like, damn, what do I do now? There's no one to fight with. Fight with your fucking self. Figure it out. Like for real. I feel like they're going through it now. I don't feel like this person has quite realized. You know, there could be some heartbreak surrounding an air sign child as well. Aquarius Libra Gemini. Somebody here is you know, giving up on a situation. They no longer, this, this brings heartache. There's a lot of untruthful communication. There's a lack of clarity. This is somebody who, you know, lacks integrity. Yeah, they lack integrity. Okay. So let's leave that there. If this reading resonates with you guys, actually, let's do a few cards from the Rebel deck. I liked doing that yesterday. That was fun. For, it. <laughs> for whoever this reading is resonating with, please, Spirit Angels and Guides, give me three cards for them. <laughs> some good shit is about to happen. Don't let your issues fuck it up. Pisces, some good shit's about to happen. Hopefully it's that vacation that you've been thinking about in this bag over here. All right, stop sleeping so damn much. Wake up, you're missing some cool shit. So somebody here may be sleeping a lot, feeling tired. Um... One thing that I've learned when I start feeling like that, okay, you know, there's weather changes and you're like, fuck, it's raining outside and you're tired. Okay. When there's normal, like shifts, um, when there's a logical explanation for how you're feeling and then, or maybe I haven't been drinking. I know I get tired when I don't drink enough water. That's like my first thing. I get fucking sleepy when I don't drink water. When I drink water, I get more energy. It's weird. But, um, also, yeah, so maybe somebody here needs to drink more water, okay? That could be a note to somebody. Um, but also, I tend to ask my guides, ask God, you know, if I'm feeling like, fuck, I'm tired and I don't know why, you know, I'll end up praying. Because a lot of times, people can project that shit onto you, you know? Depending on your situation, who you, who you mess around with, who you talk to, who you associate with, and who your fucking enemies are. Because I clearly see that somebody here was out to get you. You know, five of swords, seven of swords, this person, three of swords, and two of swords, eight of swords. You got, like, all the swords out here. Somebody here was, like, creating a lot of, like, mental fuck show, okay? And I feel like you persevered. I feel like justice is on your side up here. You know, things will be made fair and balanced in the situation. You're the empress, okay? I feel like you pulled back your energy. You pulled back your time. And someone does not understand. They refuse to, like, see things from your point of view. They don't understand. That's so crazy. Because this is, like, somebody that, like, they still don't want to tell the truth. Even though they got caught, they still lack integrity, okay? They, they still... Could be lying about a child, maybe. All right, but they're 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 gonna sit over here. They're gonna cry about it. They're gonna feel left out in the cold, feel defeated, up in their head, losing sleep at night. Three of Swords because of some type of heartbreak because somebody gave the fuck up, Pisces. That was you, right? Somebody doesn't understand why you gave up. Like you were supposed to take all this bullshit and and fucking just be okay with it and they're like why why is pisces walking away why doesn't pisces want to fight with me anymore why why i thought i had them confused oh your love spells didn't work they still 
they're fucking like they they still lack integrity king of wands reversed okay they're still trying to use you like as a weapon okay they think that they have some type of power or pull over you so whatever the situation is clearly somebody here is on some bullshit so if you're sleeping a lot just make sure that that's not a projection from this person to keep you fucking from moving forward because if you guys remember your first oracle card out here was remember to practice self-love do what it takes to um raise your vibration and don't let other people other people around you their fucked up vibrations bring you down this could be a note to myself you know you guys all know that you guys have been here with me on my journey and you know when some people like to get to acting stupid it can affect my energy that's but you know i'm all learning i'm learning here with you guys i'm learning too i'm not perfect either shit sometimes i let people affect me that don't deserve shit from me you know and i'm learning that and i'm getting better at it as as we all are right so i'm here to tell you some good shit is about to happen pisces you do you stop trying to change people that shit never fucking works yeah it never works these people need to change themselves and this person here clearly is not trying to fucking change a damn thing that's why their wish is not going to be granted that's why they're going to be sitting here in this family sorrow while you're over here on vacation being protected from negative forces beyond your control and getting to this bag all right pisces that's what i got for you if you like this reading smash the thumbs up subscribe to the channel and i'll see you guys in my next one peace